girl Tejanelle Shanari and I'm back with another video. As you guys can tell by the title, I am doing my morning and nighttime skincare routine. They have one thing in common. I have actually signed up for Curology, their subscription. If you guys don't know or have not heard about them, they have a one month subscription which is practically free. All you have to do is pay for the shipping and it was like $5 y'all. So. If you are interested in seeing how I do this morning routine, of course, Curology will not be the only brand that I'm using, but if you do want to see how I personally use all of my products, just keep on watching. So to start off, of course, I put my hair up because we don't want those type of problems, but after that, I go ahead and rinse my face with, I would say, some warm water. Um, a little more I like it a little warmer than most people but either way as long as it's warm water that's what I do and then we go into our first product was which is the cleanser um, and I absolutely love this cleanser it feels so refreshing after I use it it goes on very simply and it has no scent which I absolutely love because that means it's friendly and available to everybody that you can think of but yeah like I said like I do not feel like my pores are clogged or anything like that and I looked up a few of the ingredients so just to start off the fact that the first ingredient says water is beyond me baby okay <laughs> this is how I know like I was sold because nobody wants something that is I don't know fake I guess you could just say just to keep it simple um, so the fact that there's water as the prime ingredient is a great deal for me and then the next ingredient sorry if I butcher this name you guys I'm new to this okay is acrylate copper limer and I looked this ingredient up and it said that it was a go it was good um, of course too much of anything is not good for you but they said that it was a pass for something that was um, good for your skin and if not good it is not going to harm your skin or be toxic to the environment or anything like that so that was great and then the third ingredient was co coca coca middle propyl hydro <laughs> and this was a go as well um so yeah i was pretty pleased to see the first three ingredients were like really good and good for your skin so i try to clean my pores for about 30 seconds to a minute and it really helps um i've in the past tried for like a minute straight and you know a lot of you don't have a lot of time for that but yeah at least 30 seconds is really good so that's what i try to do right after that i go ahead and switch to much cooler water not shockingly cool but cooler water and i just yeah get it off my face and then i go in with that paper towel about two or three of them and i just lightly dampen um or pat my face you do not scrub your face with anything um and it's better to not use a towel especially one that you've already used granted you guys we are not perfect let's not even play like everybody has used a used towel at least once in their life like come on but either way if you are looking to perfect your skincare that's what i do and i would recommend it to you guys so right after that i go in with the rich moisturizer and this is 25 milliliters on um, 0.8 full ounces and again i'm liking loving this moisturizer it's like creamy but it doesn't feel heavy but it you know it feels like it's working um and then at the same time it feels somewhat light on your face um but yeah, it has a great coverage on it and everything like i feel like my pores are in check okay y'all know what i'm saying <laughs> both of these products you use um in the morning and in the evening and i love them both for both each time so yeah it's really good it definitely hydrates me for sure after using the cleanser um i feel like after using any kind of cleanser or after washing your face period you feel dry anyway um but yeah this product definitely brings me back to life for sure so i absolutely love this product and then for the morning i go in with the ordinary you guys saw this if you haven't i will definitely link it down below um or you guys can see it in the cards but yeah the ordinary the caffeine solution five percent plus egcg and this is pretty good as well so i know a couple of videos ago i was saying that i don't really have an opinion on this but as of lately like after i use my cleanser and my moisturizer and i'm going with this 
I do, I am starting to see a little bit of change. So like when I look at myself, like my eyes are looking like they're trying to flatten out, if that makes any sense. So I don't, the, the fine lines that are in there that, you know, for when I smile or just roll my eyes, they are starting to look like they're trying to kind of like flatten out. I mean, that's the best way I can put it. Um, and the dark circles are not looking as dark, if you know what I'm saying. They're not gone, obviously, but they're not looking as dark. So I appreciate that. I'm going to give it to that and another product that I use I'm going to mention in a few minutes. But yeah, um, so far I'm liking this. Like I said before, the first thing I was looking for was irritation. And I've been using this for a few days now and it's still, I do not have any irritation. So I'm going to give it a thumbs up. I like it. And then for my last step for my morning routine is the glow screen. Screen, um, by super goop and this has SPF 40 it is 1.7 full ounces or 50 milliliters and I absolutely like this like yeah it's pretty good to me like I can say I have not used sunscreen in a while and I I didn't really grow up using that you know that era like where they were saying you know black people don't really need it um, but in fact, everybody needs it. So yeah, for the one thing that I think nobody absolutely likes is that white cast. And with this, when it comes out, it's like a brownish tint. Um, but that's because of the glow that it's giving. So I do not mind that. That's the only thing that I would see. But you know, my skin tone is this pretty much the same color. So it looks pretty good on me, if I have to say. Like, I don't see a cast, if you will. Um, and I have used this whole routine, of course, uh, going into, you know, putting on my makeup and it works perfectly fine. Like I said, I feel snatched, I feel ready, I feel glowy, I feel good. So far, I am very satisfied with all these products for the morning and now we're just gonna smoothly go into the nighttime routine. So for the nighttime routine, only two products change um, and are being replaced. Instead of using my eye droplets from The Ordinary and then my sunscreen, I'm using Dr. Organic um, Rose Restoring Eye Serum. It says to use it at night and I will say that so far I think this is helping um, because I am, like I said, I've been, if I'm using that in the morning, I'm using this at night. I think both of them are helping each other with underneath my eyes. Um, so yeah, I like this as well. It's, you know, it, it hasn't had any irritations. There's no scent or anything to it. So I like this. And then of course, the last of the trio for Curology is your personalized package. So again, if you guys don't know, the thing that's different about Curology is that they absolutely tend to each client that they have. So you go online, you take a survey and you just give them a little information about your background and what your current state is, how your skin is and things like that. And then from there you will take pictures, you know, side view angles and front view angles, really up close and personal <laughs> of your skin, and then you send it off. Okay, so let's go ahead and check out what's on the back of my personalized skincare. And it says niacinamide, which is 4%, clindamycin, which is 1%, azelic acid, which is 4%. Um, and it says apply nightly. And so, yeah, I I will say something. Um, so what I told them is that I deal with acne every now and then, um, and it's the blemishes that I'm really trying to get rid of. And so for me, um, I know that acne will come around, especially if I'm on my menstrual cycle, which I'm on now, which is why I have like a couple. And so when I started using that, like, I think my menstrual was about to come on and um, so when I started using this I broke out like right over here and then a little bit right here and I was just like oh gosh but so what is giving me hope is the fact that my skin looks smoother with this whole routine um, and so I'm praying that this is going to fight with me do you feel me <laughs> so like as of right now because my menstrual is like heavy right now um i'm starting to see more but because i'm using this i'm seeing less or experiencing less of the effects of acne and stuff like that so what i'm going to be looking for is that you know that this is maintained that my skin like looks clearer um during this process and then i'm interested to see 
you know, what happens once I'm off my menstrual cycle. You know, does it help me out more or does it hinder me more? And the last thing that they sent me because of my acne proneness at times because it's not like heavy like it's really bad um they sent me a an emergency spot patch and yeah i was like super excited I was like oh my gosh if like i have a bad set i can like help me out <laughs> so it says sudden spot we've got emergencies covered with this hydrocolide patch that absorbs pus and oil just remember to apply it before your chirology cream and I'm just like, and you wait six to 24 hours and then you peel it off and you repeat it daily as needed or whatever. So I was like, I'm gonna try this when it gets really bad, okay? <laughs> but yeah, like I, so far I'm enjoying this whole process. Um, I will say it does take consistency. Like if you're off and on with your skincare routine or nighttime routine, like it just, I don't know you're not going to get everything that you want out of it um and i know i've seen a lot of people on my channel actually say that you know oh girl you you got it and all that stuff but it is really a matter of what you want out of something the fact that my channel is centered around beauty fashion and things like that i want to give you guys you know the best version of myself and actually tell you guys authentically what works for me because a lot of times people can relate to your story so yeah you guys that's all i have for you for today i hope you guys enjoyed this content as much as i did let me know down below in the comments if you're actually on your own curology journey and if you are new here hey girl go ahead and hit that subscribe button don't forget to give me a thumbs up and i will catch y'all on my next one bye